Yes, everybody, today we are looking at ssjersey.com. Relatively new, I think, to the scene. Let me know down in the comments if you ever used them before. Um, I've got four shirts to show you. They look absolutely banging. I've also gone with print as well so we can really see what the quality is like. Thank you very much for supporting the channel over the last few weeks and months. Absolutely tremendous support on the channel and in the Discord. Make sure you check out the Discord because it's absolutely free. I have loads of people talk about fake football shirts, where they get their orders from, etc. Link down in the description for that. And it is also absolutely free. All right, so we're talking about £12 or £13 for fan versions, about £15 or £16 for the player versions, which is really good value. This is SS Jersey. Little bit difficult to navigate at first. But if you're actually searching for a shirt that you want, all you need to do is just lay have past season ones, which is pretty cool. And then obviously you've got your leagues, etc. down here. You can also type it in the search menu as well. Kids kits, baby kits, training kits, retro kits, everything you'd expect. All the other ones as well, MLS, etc. EFL Championship. There you go. I do. I am a fan of the new Leeds kit and I've got even some retro ones in there as well. Okay, so three of the four shirts are player versions. Let's do the fan version one first. It is the new. El Nasser kit. There you go. Gone from Nike to Adidas. There you go on the D then, pretty good. You can see it's a medium. And of course on the back, we've still got him. I love the font, the font is absolutely brilliant. There we go. Pretty similar to the night design, but really cool. And there you go, Ronaldo on the back. Fan version, I have no harm. How much was it? Let me just check how much it was. $18 it was with the name and number on the back. You can pay by PayPal and credit card, um, I forgot to mention. As well, came in good time, sort of like that, two to three weeks, like everybody else that is kind of sending shirts out. And you're looking at about £2 to £2.50 per shirt in terms of postage. Uh, badge really good. Let me do a little zoom in on that badge because it's decent quality. There you go. That is the first one. Right, three player versions. I am I'm desperate to lose a little bit, bit of weight and not just to look good, but also so I can get involved in these player versions because people keep asking about player versions and you need to be, well, you don't need to be, but if you want to look half respectable because they fit a lot tighter fitting, it is better for the guys that are slimmer. Obviously, these are meant for the footballers. So we have gone with the Bayern Munich. This is probably my favorite home shirt so far of 24-25. And on the back, we have gone with Musiala. There you go, a really nice font again. Print feels good. Obviously, time will tell how long it lasts. That is in a large. It's also got the Mia San Mia on the back. Yeah, I'm really happy with it. I can't see anything that alarms me. It's really nice. I think it is generally one of the nicest kits of the 24-25 season. <laughs> I've just realised as well. So this is uh, another player version, shirt number three. I thought I'd gone Rafael Leao, but I've had a Rafael Leao shirt. So it is the AC Milan home shirt. Absolutely love this one as well. Just a little bit. Not as nice as the as the uh, Bayern one. It is in large, but there you go. And on the back, <laughs> we've got Teo, which is pretty cool. Yeah, it feels good. It does feel good. The, the, the improvements these factories have made over the last 12 to 18 months. A little bit of detail on the inside. We've got a City R badge. So the detailing and the quality of the print has improved over the past few months. There you go. So that is the AC Milan. I think it's probably second place, but this one is one of my favourites. Player version again. I think if you can uh, get a player version, I always would recommend sizing up for a player version because they are tight, but the player version for this looks absolutely tremendous. It's in large again. And this time, because I got an Mbappe one a while ago, we've gone Jude Bellingham. It's had really good quality. You get someone messaged, someone messaged me a while ago about the creases. The only way you can get rid of the creases is just put them on a wash. Like put it literally on a really light wash and hang it out. That's what I tend to do anyway. But that, my friends, you just see the detailing on the player version. You wouldn't get that on the fan version. You sometimes get it sort of like subliminated into the shirt, but that is a different texture. 
as you can see. And that's normally the difference is one of the differences as well with a player version. All right, everyone. I think they're four absolute bangers. Really good quality. Really happy that um, I've started using SS Jersey. Hopefully we'll get some more from them over the next few months. I think Bayern Munich, number one Bayern Munich, two Real Madrid, three Milan, four El Nasser. I think that's the best order. Let me know your thoughts down in the comments. Make sure you check out the Discord. Check out SS Jersey as well. Usual WhatsApp, really good sort of like chatting and stuff. They've messaged me the other day and said, when are you doing a video? Because so they're on it in terms of when shirts arrive and stuff. So really cool. All right, guys, thanks for watching. Take care. See you later.